Good night, people. It is now 1.15 a.m. in the morning. Before I uh, start this rant, however, I wanted to show you something. And, oh, shit. It's snowing. But this isn't what I'm going to show you. I'm also going to be doing a rant in the dark. Okay now, people, N now we can get started. I'm here to talk about Cartoon Eric Airy, they're, they're very, the very first ever Hall, Hall of Game Awards. I think it starts this Sunday, though. I'm not sure what time it is, though, but it's, gonna, but it's also going to be hosted by Tony Hawks, the professional skateboarder, and some other thing, us uh, and some other crap like that. <sighs> Don't quote me on this though, because I don't watch Cartoon Network anymore. I only check it out the channel. I only check out the channel once in a while for some of the great shows there. I mean, anyway, what's what in the fuck Cartoon Network is? What in the fuck Cartoon Network is trying to air more sports related crap for? I mean, they've already aired some of the some of the sports programs from in the past, such as. Such as the rejected slam bar program, which which is which has now been canceled, along with uh, my dad's a pro. Well, it's not really canceled, or it's just off the air. But whatever, they're just trying to add more crap to it. That's in fact cartoon cartoon. They're just trying to uh, copy es. They're just trying to become the new ESPN. Or they're just trying to look similar to ESPN channel by adding any sports related programs there. I mean, I don't know. I don't. I don't get what. What's the fucking point, though? They might as well just rename the damn channel. <sighs> but anyway, seriously. If but seriously, if they keep adding more sports related programs, then they might as well just re. Rename the channel, but just tell you the truth, airing it's just a airing sports related programs on Cartoon Network. It's a complete waste. It's just a complete waste. And I've also heard they they also, they've already showed a movie like Speed Racer, the movie, and Space Jam. Space Jam is one of my favorite movies, though. But I prefer what I'm sorry, I meant to say. Uh, I've watched Space Jam the movie since the day after Thanksgiving on Encore Channel. Just just for one day and I think I I prefer watching it on the Encore Channel. However, I'm not subscribed to it so I won't be able to see it anytime soon. But seriously, at least they but seriously, Space Jam is a great movie but it shouldn't be on Cartoon Network and that goes with Speed Racer. It should be on. Well, you get the picture. And of course, I also got some bad news to tell you. For those of you who watched, for those of you who checked out the Power Girls, it's been it's been removed from the schedule again. Seriously, the Power Girls has been taken off the, off the schedule again. So if some of you didn't get a chance to watch watch the Power Puff Girls, then I'm sorry, you're out of luck. You're way out of. Seriously, if you didn't watch the Powerpuff Girls, then you're definitely out of luck. You might as well just have to get the D DVD set instead. Luckily, Dex, but don't lose hope though because Dexter's laboratory is still active. Well, but only temporarily, along with Ed and Eddie. Seriously, Ed and Eddie is still active on Cartoon Network, along with Courage the Cowardly Dog, The Grim Adventures of Billy and Maddie, and, and of course, codename Kids Next Door. Anyway, I'm still. I'm, anyway, I'm still very dis. I'm still very disappointed, though. Well, not just that, but I kind of feel sorry for Cartoon Network because sooner or later, Cartoon Network may want may go out of business. You know. If Cartoon Network doesn't shape up, they could go bankrupt and they wind up going out of business. I mean, I don't want Cartoon Network to die. I, 
They just need to uh turn they just need to turn around and get their act together and and rebuild its reputation because seriously Cartoon Network is starting to lose its reputation on account of on account of corruption from on account of corruption from the from the employees including the president Cartoon Network Studios and its channel has been corrupted even Boomerang is Boomerang Network is showing signs of corruption ever since they started to air Hole in the Wall since October of 2010, which led to its ultimate, well, corruption. And, uh, <clears throat> and also, uh, oh yeah, and also Stuart Snyder is still active as the president of Cartoon Network, so... I'm just here to tell you, just stop spreading rumors about it. He 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 is still active. He neither resign nor terminate. Okay, just seriously, people, stop with all the rumors. All right. Oh yes, and final. Oh yes, and uh, well, and finally, some, and finally, for those of you who like Chowder, Adventure Time with Finn and Jake. The Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack, and of course, regular show, and, well, no offense, not, I'm not offended though, but I'm glad you all enjoyed it. Sure, I liked a Adventure Time just a little bit, I'm not, a, I'm not really much of a big fan of the show. But anyway, that's about it, I can't explain it anymore. But seriously, Cartoon Air needs to get its act together or they could lose a lot of or they could go bankrupt and lose their business. If they seriously, they could lose their they could lose their viewers, money, and they could lose their business if they don't get their act together. And finally, they seriously need to get Snyder out of the office. And I don't and I don't give a damn about if if some Vice President will fill in for Stuart Snyder. I mean, I mean, if if the real president, if I mean, if Hannah Barbera was still, if William Hannah and Joseph Barbera was still alive, Snyder would have would have got gotten his ass fired. Anyway, that is all you need to know. That's all. That's all you need to hear from me. And I thank you for watching. Good night, everybody.